Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to the channel. So today I have James with me to <laughs> discuss different stocking stuffer ideas for him. There's a little bit of a variety here, so we're just gonna go through real quick and give you guys some ideas for this Christmas season. So if your guy is someone who likes to go to the gym or maybe has a New Year's resolution coming up to go to the gym, the, the perfect gift that could fit perfectly into a stocking would be a nice headband. Mm -hmm. Whatever his brand is, Nike Under Armour, there's always a nice looking, sleek looking headband. Headband is a really great idea because um, it's super cheap, first off, and it's something you always usually overlook, you know what I mean? It's right by the checkout line usually, so it's a perfect little add-on. This one in particular is Nike that I picked up for James, um, and it retailed for $13, so way under $20. It is the perfect, and it's super comfortable, mm -hmm. flexible, you could tie it, it's adjustable. I feel like any guy who's into fitness could definitely use this. Mm -hmm. When she got this for me, uh, we used it for when we went hiking. You know what I mean? So it's indoor, outdoor, it's very versatile and uh, helps keep your hair out of your face and keep the sweat out of your eyes, definitely. So ladies, I'm a really big fan of different style socks. I feel like socks, along with ties, are a wonderful accessory to be able to express your personality. Um, you, there's thousands and thousands of designs that you could choose from um, anywhere from flamingos to beers to floral patterns to really cool geometric shapes. Um, socks are a wonderful way for a guy to express his personality all while maintaining that professionalism. These ones in particular are from Express. Express has a really nice selection of socks. Uh, they tend to be seasonal as well, so if you guys want to see, they might have some Christmas trees or candy canes or something like that. Um, these usually retail at about 10, 11 bucks each, but they are always doing sales. And they're super high quality too. They, they're not gonna, uh, for guys who know about wearing dress socks, they slide sometimes and they don't really fit too well. Uh, these are nice, they're, they, they fit perfectly. And uh, so ladies, if you're considering picking something up like this for your man, just make sure you keep track of the shoe size because typically with socks like these, they are not one size fits all. Ladies, if you have a particular TV show that you love to binge watch with your man or if you have a favorite band or a favorite movie, uh, don't be afraid to hit up websites like Redbubble, um, Etsy. They all have really great products uh, crafted, personalized um, with all different forms of media. So for example, Ashley and I uh, love The Office. We watch The Office all the time. Uh, we're obsessed with it. We think it's amazing. So last year as a stocking stuffer, Ashley got me, those of you uh, familiar with the show will get this completely. Uh, she got me my own personal Dundee and uh, inscribed on the bottom, it is the Best Boyfriend Award. That's right. I will definitely have the website linked below in case you guys are considering creating one up for yourself. Um, you can get anything put right here on the label. Um, and it was definitely under $20, but um, yes, yeah, so I had to get a Dundee Award. It was like a little inside personal thing between us. You ladies have that with your man and you binge watch Netflix or a particular show like we do, which I know most of you do, yeah. then finding something related to that merchandise wise mm -hmm. is a really good idea. Yeah, I'm a big fan of simple, small little accessories that you can find. Um, masculine accessories that you can find in the stores like H&M. Express. Yeah, ex exactly, you. yeah. Um, they always have their own specific guy section um, that tend to have really great things and pretty relatively cheap. I know uh, I'm a big fan of bracelets, necklaces, but not the flashy kind. I like more of like the earth tone earth kind of yeah, stuff. Yeah, very earthy looking, um, yeah. kind of like leather material. Mm -hmm. Ones that are very easy to put on, either have like Stretchy. the stretch material or ones that are just a it's very simple like magnetic clasp, mm -hmm. things like that. You know, you don't want to spend forever putting on jewelry, but you know, if you're going out like a date night or something and you want to kind of semi-dress up, mm -hmm. you want a little something something, or if you're wearing a plain t-shirt, these are perfect. Very dark, like earthy and like manly colors. Yeah. So very inexpensive. I think what it, that was only like five bucks. Yeah. Yeah. Um, and there are different packs geared towards specific styles. So next 
up. If your guy is into like techie type of things, computer related, or especially if your man is in school, college, things like that, this would be particularly useful. Getting him a wireless mouse for his laptop. These are silent clickers, which come really in handy. You know all about it, guys. There's nothing more annoying than trying to get work done or studying and hearing somebody click away on their mouse. It's just like, mm -hmm. it's just one of those little pet peeves. I don't know, same with clicking pens. But yeah, um, this is really nice looking. Uh, they have a bunch of different types of colors, designs. It, you can find one that matches like his case if he has one for his laptop or you could even buy both and this could just be in the stocking and the other one could be as an actual gift. So this one in particular matched James's laptop case and it's perfect for when he goes to school because he could click away and ain't nobody gonna know. These definitely can range in price. This one works very well and we got it off of Amazon for literally like $10. Yeah, not even. Yeah, so they're really inexpensive. You cannot go wrong. This one is black and gold. All right, so I don't know about your man, but I am a comic book nerd. Rest in peace, Stan Lee. Uh, I'm a big fan of Batman, Superman, of course, you know, who isn't? But she actually found these at Five Below, believe it or not, and I'm pretty sure they were $5 and below, so the store lived up to its name. Um, <laughs> These are, below, baby. These are really cool because they're not just regular, they're not just the regular Batman, Superman, you know, little action figures or anything. They're actually the old school vintage superheroes from the 1940s. Um, I've never seen these before outside of these two little guys. I do know they come in different packs with different superheroes, the whole Justice League, everything like that. Um, they sit right on my desk, they keep me company, um, super cheap, and they're really cool. I've never seen these in the stores and um, they're my little buddies. So yeah, if your man is into superheroes, consider getting him uh, a badass action figure. So another small little accessory you can get for the superhero nerd, comic book nerd, is uh, a lanyard, actually. Believe it or not, stores like uh, Hot Topic and Spencer's sell really cool lanyards, wallets, different, pers uh, different superhero accessories. I never would have thought to buy myself a Superman lanyard, but when I found this in my stocking from Ashley a couple years ago, I was head over heels because it's so cool. I never would have thought to buy myself, you know, a superhero themed lanyard. So take that into consideration too. They're super cheap, only a couple bucks. I mean, it doesn't just have to be superhero. You can find something for anybody. Mm -hmm. So no matter what their interest is, like whether it's um, like a TV show mm -hmm. or just like an item or something, whatever it is, uh, you will definitely find one personalized towards them. So Hot Topic is really good for this, yeah. but I'm sure you can also find one on Amazon, which I will find mm -hmm. and be linking it down below. If your man is a food junkie, like this chubby checker right here, <laughs> uh, something that is really popular these days because of YouTube channels like Hot Ones, um, it are hot sauces. Hot sauces are kind of becoming super trendy with all the different flavors, all the different brands and stuff like that. So uh, if your man is a food junkie, don't, don't shy away from maybe grabbing him a bottle of unique, different hot sauce. They come in a million different flavors, varieties, so even if your man doesn't like too spicy, there's a lot of different really nice flavorful sauces, or if you want to challenge him, Get the one that you have to like sign a contract for saying you won't sue them if you die. Um, <laughs> Other than just like one big one, you can also get, they sell them everywhere, like mini packs. They'll come mm -hmm. with like three or four in it so that they can maybe have a nice variety. There's a lot of different kinds you could choose from. So based on his preference and how well you know him, mm -hmm. you, can get def you can definitely find like a nice hot sauce that you think he would like. Mm -hmm. For example, this one is a Cajun hot sauce. And this one is a garlic hot sauce. Two flavors that Ashley here knows I like. So what does she do? She takes the best of both worlds. She combines them and finds a gift geared towards the flavor. Mm -hmm. If your man is somebody who loves scents and has his like room smelling good or office or whatever, do not think candles are just a feminine thing because they ain't, okay? No, no, no. I found a super inexpensive selection at TJ Maxx Marshalls. They have really, they have a really great brand called Manly Indulgence. Mm. Check it out. The scents on these are like colognes, like musky, like 
the woody smells. Just, oh my God, this one's so good. It's this amazing. one in particular that we got is called Dark Forest. And I think I got him another one, but I don't know where that one is. Oh, it's right here. Oh, so I got James one in Dark Forest scent and the other one is Black Sandalwood. These are super inexpensive. I believe this was about $15 if I'm not mistaken. Um, but Manly Indulgence is great. It burns really well. These are soy blend candles, so a little more natural. And I mean, honestly, this will fit in a stocking. Believe me, mm -hmm. I've tried. And it's just a great way to go. Okay guys, so going off of fragrance, another really nice and super inexpensive stocking stuffer would be Bath & Body Works hand sanitizers. Mm -hmm. I mean, I actually never knew that they had like manly scents, but when I went into Bath & Body Works, they do. They have like a manly line of scents. And this one is in the scent Noir. And oh my God. Mm -hmm. Yes, it smells fantastic. It smells like a cologne. I mean, James uses this all the time. Mm -hmm. It's perfect to just even keep in your car. And in your book bag, your briefcase. Yes, yeah, so you can keep it anywhere. And last but not least, guys, this particular gift is for those of you who have a man in your life with none other than a beard. Chances are if he has any sort of facial hair, he is no stranger to the threat of beard itch. I found two really great products that will work wonderfully as stocking stuffers for your man with a beard. Um, the first one is Maestro's Beard Wash. I picked this up from uh, Target, actually. Uh, it was a little on the price, you're sorry, at $12, but it goes a very long way. I've had this for a while, and I'm not even halfway through with it. I use it all the time. Um, it's literally a shampoo for your beard, so it not only does it nourish and moisturize your, your facial hair, um, but it also gives it like a very sleek, very kind of shine to it, makes it look very clean, and it smells amazing, you guys. It really smells great. Um, so yeah. It does smell great, because I noticed like, yeah, like it made a huge mm -hmm. difference, but from before he, before when he didn't use a beard wash, actually he was using my good shampoo. I didn't appreciate that very much. Yeah, it, dried, it dried my beard out. <laughs> it dried his beard out. Oh. Guys, uh, apparently I didn't know this, but beard hair and regular hair are two totally different animals. Like you cannot use the same products on both. Mm -hmm. They need their own special treatment. Mm -hmm. So I know this now because his beard's bigger than ever. Last but not least, you guys, to bounce off of the idea of a in-shower beard wash, uh, consider doing a, grabbing him a beard balm. They are really great. It's almost like a nourishing uh, gel, in a sense, for your beard. It helps style your beard. It helps keep it nice and sharp and contained and not all crazy and out there. Um, it smells really great and it has a ton of nutrients and vitamins in there, to, in there to help nourish your own beard and inspire it to grow. So this is from the brand Cremo. I hope I'm pronouncing that right, but it is also from Target. It runs about the same as the beard wash, about, what, like 10? 10, 15, it depends 10 where 15. you go. I know they sell it at Walmart. Um, I bought this one in particular from Target. Mm -hmm. All right guys, so that was it. Those were our stocking stuffer ideas for him. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and got some ideas and inspiration of your own. I honestly could go on and on with ideas for you, but um, yeah, I just kind of wanted to narrow it down and just go into detail and depth as to why it would be suitable for your man. Yeah. Just like that, it all fits. <laughs> And this is a medium sized one too, folks. I also do have a stocking stuffer gift ideas for her on the channel. So I will link that down below in case you guys are interested in checking that one out. I will also try to find everything that I showed you and have it linked below or something very similar at least. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And please don't forget to subscribe. I make new videos every week and sometimes they will have this man in it, sometimes not. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Can you, you gotta get in frame more, your head's... Oh god, come on, don't Ready? look scary. It's my normal face. You don't look scary. <laughs> oh, what the heck is that? <laughs> Absolutely not. No. Nope. Okay, ready? Yeah. <laughs> it looks like we're struggling so hard to fit this stocking it in is, frame. It is, like... <laughs> you gotta contort your body. <laughs> How about you look in it? Just look in the stocking like... <laughs> Do it. Okay, okay, ready, ready. <laughs>
Go. Ready? <laughs> You're supposed to look happy, not like disgusted. Here. <laughs> Don't look at me. I see your eyes. <laughs> Um, these are just a few ideas. I mean, I could honestly go on and on with different um, things to stock a stuffing with. 